Virginia Military Institute is wrapping up its school year by marking another historic milestone in its nearly 200 year history. Today, the Institute welcomed its first female leader of the Corps of Cadets. 10 News reporter Annie Schroeder is working for you tonight to show how the military school hopes this will pave the way for other female leaders. Cadet Casey Meredith is making history at Virginia Military Institute. She is the first female to lead its Corps of Cadets in nearly 200 years. It's amazing to see the way that I've grown here. Her leadership comes at the end of a year full of sweeping changes on post, from the removal of the Stonewall Jackson statue to the selection of the Institute's first black superintendent, Major General Cedric Wins. We define uh, what it means to be uh, a VMI cadet and a young person of character, uh, and they have not wavered from that, not one bit. And so I'm very proud of that. Wynn says Meredith has proven herself time and time again as a natural born leader. And while she may be the first female regimental commander, he knows she won't be the last. I have no doubts that uh, she is going to win the trust and confidence of her classmates. She's al already done that. And you see that she has those leadership characteristics that we like to see in young leaders. Meredith says during her leadership, she wants her fellow cadets to experience VMI to the fullest and restore its sense of tradition after the pandemic. This is the culminating moment of my cadetship is just getting a position I wasn't ever sure that I could get. And VMI taught me to reach for opportunities and to, and to try for new things. While the female population among the Corps of Cadets has grown exponentially over the years, Meredith hopes she can continue to pave the way for future cadets from all backgrounds to follow in her footsteps. I'm ready. I'm ready to do this. I want to do this. And I want to be the best for everybody here. In Lexington, Annie Schroeder, 10 News, working for you. And today is special for another reason. This weekend, hundreds of cadets at VMI will graduate in person. The cadets will take part in their first in-person ceremony since the pandemic started late last year.